Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hope you're all well. What a massive, massive weekend it's been for Newcastle United. They have smashed Villa at St James's Park. Five goals to one. Wow, what an opening start to the season. Uh, they send a message basically to all the Premier League teams. We're here for business. Um, we are top four. We're in the Champions League this year. We're going, we're going to have another good season. I believe in these players. It's absolutely fantastic. It was a wonderful, wonderful win. You know, goals from um, Sandro Tonali on his debut, Harvey Barnes, Isaac. Um, absolutely fantastic stuff. And even Cam Callum Wilson got one as well off the bench. So, massive, massive win. You know what I mean? Huge, huge win for Newcastle United. Um, but, we're here to talk about transfer news, transfer rumours. Newcastle United are in the market for one more player, and it is a left back. We know for a fact that we're a bit short on that side. After just last week, we send, signed Tino Livermento from um, Southampton. So we've got cover at the right back for him and Trippier. But the left back situation, we are short there. You know, we've got Matt Target, you no know, Dan Burns playing there now, but do I believe Dan Burns play there all season and Champions League football and stay fit? I don't know. He's not really a left back. But he's been outstanding at left back. But he isn't the quickest. And we know that. And if you're playing like some big, big clubs and they've got a really rapid right winger, um, you're going to have a lot, a lot of trouble. So that's the area we need strengthened. And the two players who have been linked with Newcastle United, calling the Telegraph, are Kieran Turney from Arsenal and Mark Cucurella from Chelsea. These two players have been looked at by Newcastle United for a loan with probably an obligation to buy um, or something to do like a permanent deal with instalments because with FFP we can't respend. Really It'll have to be like instalments over a period of time, bit by bit. It makes total sense. But these two players for me are fantastic. Um, Kieran Turney for me, he is a really good left back. He's outstanding, you know, um, he can score a screamer. He got goals, assists, he can dribble, um, pick, picks out the right pass in the box um, for your striker to score. Um, very good decision making at the end, the final third, which we need. And he also can take a player on. Um, he's a fantastic left back, but we all know Arsenal have got Shizhenko at the left back, and Kieran Tierney is the second choice under um, Arteta. So he could be looking for a move away from. Um, the Emirates, we're looking at him, and the other one is, is Marco Cucurella, we all know Marco Cucurella hasn't really done that well at Chelsea, after his 50 million plus move, whatever it was, from um, Brighton, just a couple of transfer windows ago, you know, um, but if we're looking what he was like at Brighton, he was amazing, again, great dribbler, um, aggressive, um, very good player, you know, across the ball in, Good sliding tackles. He's actually quite a good defender on his day. Um, for Brighton, that wasn't anyways. And I think he's a great player. Um, if I was going to pick one, I don't know. My head's just saying Kukurella for some reason. But Kieran Turney is still an outstanding one. But my first choice would be Mark Kukurella. Simple as that. I think he's a really good player. And I think if Newcastle and Eddie Howe can bring a 25-year-old in and get his form to where he was at Brighton, which I believe Eddie Howe can do with any player. It's, look what he's done to players so far, like Joe Linton and stuff like that. He's made all these players, um, and Murphy, he's made these players um, much better than what they are. And that's a quality in Eddie Howe. He's um, one-on-one -on -one management. So Cucurella for me is fantastic. We'll have a little look at the stats there. Cucurella, you know, he... Um, He's a Spanish player. He was born in Spain. He play a left back, left wing back. He can overlap the um, left winger as well, which Newcastle love. Which, if you look at Dan Byrne overlapping, he's not really got a final third, Dan Byrne, um, that we need if we're in Champions League football. Cucurella can um, do that. Um, you know, he's youth um, academy. He played for a Spaniel until he went to Barcelona. He's played for Barcelona, he's went on loan to a few um, Spanish clubs, Ebor, Getafe, um, before signing for Getafe properly in 2020. He also signed for Brighton 2021 to 22. He was only there for a season until um, he signed for Chelsea in 22 for a massive, like, it was £50 million. 
um, from Brighton. But he is a class player, like I said before. He can do everything across the board. He's pacey, he's got skills in him. You know, Spanish players are always skillful. I believe Cucurella, mate, <clears throat> is um, a really, really good player. And, um, yeah, I'd love to see him at Newcastle United. But if it isn't him, Kevin Turney, on the other hand, is just as good. It's just my opinion that I'd have Cucurella um, over him. That's just the way I, I see it. But, um, yeah, um, we'll look at Kevin Turney now. He starts... Um, This kid started his youth career at Celtic, um, and then he finally made his debut for Celtic 2015. He scored five goals, 102 appearances for them, um, first signed for Arsenal 2019, where he's played 91 games with three goals. He's also played for Scotland in the 18s and 19s, and he got his debut for the Scottish national team in 2016, where he's had 39 caps for Scotland and one goal. When you look at these two players, these are um, stamp hit the peaks yet, you know. Um, Corella's 25, I think. Um, Kevin Turney's 26. You know, um, um, he's more... I just believe that these two players are quality. And if we can get these on loan at Newcastle United, I think it'll be a, a very good transfer window, you know what I mean? Like, um, bringing in Sandro Trinali. He has been a breath fresh air. What a debut for him. People seeing that he might need time to gel in. He doesn't... He was running that midfield, doing the right pass at the right time. I love the Harvey Barnes assist, by the way, where bomb, 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 and Harvey Barnes was in for that goal. That was incredible, that one. Um, I think that was the fifth goal, but that was definitely an amazing pass by Sandro Schnorli. And for how old, 23 years of age, we've got the next Perlo on our hands for £50 million. It's an absolute steal for me. And then you've got the other ones coming in, you know, um, Harvey Barnes, outstanding again, a preceding the seller, Corpe scored a goal, you know, the two debuts scored a goal, you couldn't get a much better debut than that than them two, Harvey Barnes, it's absolutely fantastic, you know, Livermento, he was on the bench as well, um, he's another one who's going to be fantastic for us, because um, he just looks really good as well, he's fantastic, and these three players are coming, we've obviously signed Menta as well, you know, but... These players have come in are absolute quality. Livermento, Sandro Schnorri and Harvey Barnes are definitely making Newcastle United stronger. And we are class. But one more signing, I think it'll be a loan deal. And I think it'll be one of these players, either Kevin Turney or Marco Cucurella. And that is who will be coming to Newcastle United. I truly believe it. Newcastle United are not finishing the market yet. Unless they sell someone and get some money and then put a bid in for one of these, that could happen as well. But... We'll have to see what happens. The transfer window, see if anyone else will leave the football club. Uh, I would have thought they would have done if an offer comes in for anyone. You know, if it's right, like I said, like they've said before, if it's right for the club, they'll do the business. But with FFP, right, we're off at the moment in time because we haven't got much revenue at the moment. We're looking at two, three, four years down the line. We can spend the big, big money. Um, for now, a loan deal for the, this one of these players will be absolutely perfect for the club. Um, but we'll have to see if their clubs, Arsenal. Uh, Chelsea will do do this, you know, I think that um, Cucurella one could happen because I don't think he's going to play on the potch, I'm not really sure, I watched Chelsea the other day, I don't think he was playing, I think he was on the bench, um, and Kevin Turney doesn't get a game because of um, Shevchenko, the Ukrainian, so let me know in the comment section who would you rather have, Kevin Turney or Mark Cucurella and Newcastle United, so I believe one of these deals will get done, and also if you let me subscribe, that'd be great, thank you very much people, I'll see you on the next one.